Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I have been very MIA lately. Life has been freaking crazy right now. Um, so I finally got a day to kind of slow down and just take a breath and work on some social media stuff. Um, here lately I have been very successful with my social medias which I am super thankful for. I've been able to make social media more of my income now so I don't have to work as much. So thank you guys for always watching and supporting. Today I'm going to be doing kind of like what I get in a week as a micro influencer on Instagram and stuff like that. Kind of show you how I do it. Um, if interested I can always do a video on how I make my money on Instagram and stuff like that with through brand deals um, that is a whole totally different video there's so much work that goes into it I feel like a lot of people just think what I do is like just putting on a cute outfit and taking a picture and there is so much more that goes into it um, I do work very hard and I'm not trying to brag at all in this video about the things I get because I do work very hard and I have wanted to do this for so long and I have been able here recently to kind of make it my full-time job which is so awesome and I am so excited so I'm gonna show you kind of what I've gotten in about the last week week and a half um, I've really gotten some cool stuff from different companies I want to give them a shout out um, show you guys uh, leave discount codes down in the comments and I will link everything if you want to buy something but other than that, let's jump into the video. I don't know how I'm going to show you guys this, but the first company I want to talk about is a company I have tried to be in contact with before. Um, a lot of times when you are starting out, you know, companies don't want to work with you for paid gigs. Um, they'll send you stuff for free, but if you're wanting to kind of make it more of a career, you need to have your media kit and stuff like that in order for this to work. I reached out to this company. I think twice in the past trying to get them to work with me and got denied both times but this time they were the ones to send me an email and I was so excited um, so this brand is called Velvet Caviar they are a phone case company and they have got some of the cutest phone cases and they let me pick out a couple things um, I thought the boxing was so adorable like look at that it has like all kinds of different things on it and I'm obsessed. I didn't want to take it out of the box. And when you open it up, we got a handwritten note, which was super sweet. And then they also had sent a few extra things. I was just expecting to get a key or a phone case out of it, but they also had sent a phone grip stand, which was lip print. Um, they know me too well. I think they were stalking my page a little bit because I am obsessed with the lip print. And they also sent over a really cute keychain with lips on it as well. Um, so cute, but I am in love with this phone case. They let me pick this out and it was hands down. Like as soon as I saw it, I was like, okay, that's the one. So freaking cute. It's got lips all over it. I am so excited to do my collaboration with this one. Um, like I said, I've been trying to work with Velvet Caviar for a very long time. So this is like super exciting. I feel like some of my work is starting to pay off. I'm able to kind of work with brands that have turned me down in the past and collaborations with them now, which is like super cool. If you're looking for a phone case, definitely check out Velvet Caviar. They have some of the cutest stuff. They have a ton to select from and I know you'll find one that you like. Okay, so the second company I'm going to show you guys actually reached out to me. I feel like Western purses are becoming more and more popular every day. I was yet, never really into them super much. Ed and Fringe had sent me over an email, um, let me pick out a couple of purses, and they are so cute. I definitely did not disappoint, and I'm pretty obsessed with it. Um, so in my PR package from Hide and Fringe, I got this super cute handwritten note again, um, cute little packaging, and then they also sent over this they let me pick out this purse um so cute it's got that hide fringe all over it i don't know if you can see it up close but it's just like a little crossbody bag um super adorable i'm obsessed with mini purses i don't like a humongous purse which is weird because i carry a lot of stuff and i always complain that it never fits but i carry a small purse but this is so freaking cute and 
I am obsessed with it. I'm filling on a Western photo shoot here very soon with this one. I am so excited. So if you're in the market for a Western purse, definitely check out Hide and Fringe. The girls are so sweet to work with and they are gonna make sure that you get the best bag possible. So the next company I'm gonna show you is my newest and most recent one that I have taken on as partnership with. If you follow me on Instagram, I have been promoting this one. It's a huge company. I love this. I've been using their product for almost a year, even before this collaboration. So I'm super excited to announce that I am now in partnership with Hydro Drug. Um, if you don't know what Hydro Drug is, it's these super massive, I don't know if you can tell next to my head, but they're huge jugs of water, or I fill mine with water, I guess you could put whatever you wanted into it. But these things, like I take it to work with me um, and it will last me all day. Um, so you're not having to like fill up your water and take a whole bunch of water bottles in a day, just carry this thing around. They also have sleeves, which I cannot show you yet because that is still a surprise for everybody, but they have sleeves and you can kind of put it around like and carry it as a purse. And so the next one I have, and I'm probably going to butcher the name on this one. It is Maria Nyla, a vegan and cruelty free hair care company. Um, they sent over this package about last week. I thought the PR package for this one was so adorable. Like it's like a magnet and it opens. And then I, what I got, I also had another handwritten note from them, which was super sweet. I love when companies do like the handwritten notes. I don't know, it just makes it more um, personal and knowing that somebody took the time out to like pack your own package just for you to promote to your following. I think it's just super cool. But I've been using this stuff for the past week and my hair has been so dang soft. This is like one of the best shampoos I think I've ever used. And I'm not just saying that just because they are in partnership with me. This stuff is amazing. So they sent over a shampoo and it smells so good. The conditioner as well. And this is my favorite part. They sent over like a hair mask. I've actually never really tried a hair mask that I've like been like in love with, but this stuff has been so good like my hair is so soft put it on after you wash your hair leave it in for a couple minutes and then rinse it out it looks just like a lotion um it smells amazing i'm already like i feel like halfway done with the thing and i just got this looks so much even healthier and shinier since i've been using this stuff as well so if you're in the market for a new shampoo conditioner hair mask definitely check them out and i will have them linked below my last company of this video is obviously Sheen. I have been in partnership with Sheen. It is my biggest sponsorship that I have. So you can use my code 5 the Haley 15 for all your Sheen orders. It usually always covers shipping plus takes off a couple extra dollars depending on how much you spend at checkout. But I'm going to try on my Sheen clothes and show you. I haven't even, I just got it like in the mail just a while ago. Um, so I'm super excited to see what it all looks like. So we're going to try it on together. Okay, so this top is so freaking cute. I am obsessed with fringe. If you know me personally, you know I love pink, fringe, and rhinestone. That's like my top three favorites. So this shirt is so me. I love this color too. Um, it's yellow. I don't know if you can really tell because my lighting in here is not the greatest. But I kind of wish all of these tops would have came in sooner, beginning of summer, just because we are starting to go into fall now but they are still super cute it is the ties down here. I'm a sucker for the shirts that tie this one. This one is so freaking cute. I love the print of this. I love the floral print. I used to not really care for it, but here recently I have really been into it. It's got kind of the puffer sleeves on this one. This one might be my favorite out of the batch. I'm not sure though. So I love this one. Uh, definitely have to wear a different kind of bra. Um, but I don't know if you can kind of see, but it is just a short little pink dress with the sides cut out. These dresses are, these dresses have been so popular all summer long, and I think they're going to be very popular going into fall as well. Um, I cannot wait to see what I come up with styling this one. Um, it's so cute. It gives me all the Barbie vibes. So I know I said that the floral was my favorite, but after I tried this one on, it's definitely my favorite. It's so me. So I had to back up the camera a little bit so you can kind of see all the details at the bottom. It is just a little black dress with the rhinestone fringe. I don't know if you can really see that though. 
Good job, Shane. You did well. Um, but other than that, that is it for today's video. Um, thank you guys again so much for watching, and I'm sorry I've been so MIA lately. I'm going to work on trying to get a YouTube video out every single week. But other than that, everyone stay safe and take care of yourself. Uh, and I'll see you next time. Bye.